Okay, we are watching the um, ISSFanClub.com website, and you can see the footprint of the International Space Station starting to approach the Pacific Northwest. And you can see my little Google push pin locator for my QTH or location here in Portland, the wonderful Pacific Northwest. And we're hoping that we're going to get to talk to Colonel Wheelock one more time as he passes through the Pacific Northwest. November Alpha 1 Sierra, Sierra Kilo Fox 7, Echo Tango, X-Ray, Portland. Very good having you over our skies again, sir. Godspeed to you. I've been enjoying your pictures on TwitPic. Yeah, thanks, Dave. Uh, yeah, I uh, just have really uh, tried to get to the window as much as possible. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's hard to do, but uh, we try to set timers uh, when we look and we have good passes both day and night. And uh, been really, uh, been really enjoying uh, uh, seeing the, the sights at night in different cities and the uh, at the outlines of coastlines and stuff, which is really fascinating. I finally got this camera to cooperate with us. Uh, uh, got this D3S, uh, this really, really nice uh, Nikon camera that we've been using and getting some great night shots over. I enjoyed the last one that you posted, uh, juggling fresh fruits. Um, I could almost um, appreciate as well the smell and anticipation of fresh fruits and food from Earth. Over. Well, thank you for sharing those on TwitPic, and I've been following them with uh, with great enjoyment. And again, thank you for enhancing my experience as an amateur radio operator. It's been fun talking with you. I got my first QSL, and I'm going to wish you 73 for other contacts. Godspeed, sir. Thank you, Dave. Yeah, I've, just, I've had a lot of fun. Uh, I've kind of knew it this as well. I just really started with ham radio when I came up here to space, and so I'm hoping to um, hopefully uh, get a chance to meet you guys. I'm going to try to do uh, maybe some. Uh, Well, I'll tell you, it would be a great pleasure to shake your hand. That would be icing on the cake, and I look forward to every pass, and um, looking forward to you coming back to Earth, but I'll miss my favorite amateur radio operator up in space. KF-7 ETX, clear. KF-7 uh, ETX, uh, thanks a lot, David. I really appreciate it, and, uh, and uh, hopefully we can, uh, we can get others to, to, to get involved as well. Over. Well, I'm not hearing a lot of other contacts. I'm wondering if you could just quickly talk about your return to planet Earth. Yeah, absolutely. Um, well, this time, uh, you know, my last message. I lost uh, most of that. I'm hoping you're going to be around on the next uh, flyover. We'll be standing by, but uh, thank you so much. 73. Okay, so one of the great experiences with amateur radio, of course, is exchanging QSL cards, and I got my first... NA1SS QSL card in the mail, which was very exciting. And um, I'm going to stay on top of it this time. I'm sending my QSL out for this contact today. So more on QSL cards uh, in a future video, by the way. But boy, what a great, um, what a great uh, QSO with uh, Colonel Wheelock. And he certainly has been quite the ambassador for NASA uh, space program as well as amateur radio. And if you haven't checked out his photos from space. I'll put a link down below, but you have to check out Astro Wheels on TwitPic. So. Huh. Did you have the uplink? You had the uplink? We're, I'm talking to Pat right now on the on the phone. Did you have the uplink and downlink set correctly? Yeah, 144490. For the uplink? That's the one that I talk on. Correct. And then 145800. 
800 on the downlink and um, remember your radio has the ability to adjust for Doppler effect so at the beginning of the pass you want to set it for um, 805 midway through the pass 800 and at the end uh, 795 he, you know, last time I talked with him, he, um, because they're, they've been out of sync with the Pacific Northwest and they're back in sync, and uh, I think it was on my last video, but he gave a shout out to you and uh, couldn't remember your call sign, but he re clearly remembered talking to you and uh, wanted to give you his best. So we just got to keep working on it with you. VX7? V oh, you have the same as mine, VX8R? Yeah. Okay, I'll bring my go bag with me, which has a manual in it, and I'll, uh, I'll, print well I'll print off one and, and put it on a disc for you okay all right all right thank you all right see you later okay. bye okay well that was my buddy uh pat um kf7 lyb and um we work together and he's very excited about amateur radio so it's it's fun to share that with him but uh, he heard me talking to colonel wheelock called me up he was having some problems with his radio and almost always this is operator error on our behalf. So I'm going to try and help him sort that out and get him on the air and make a good QSO with NA1SS. All right, USNER doc, out till the next pass. Okay, well, welcome back. We are five minutes away from the 2308 through 2317 UTC pass over the Pacific Northwest the 8th of November 2010 by the International Space Station. We just had a great uh, pass and talked with Colonel Wheelock, also known as Astro Wheels, who is operating the amateur radio station November Alpha 1 Sierra Sierra on board the International Space Station. So I'm hoping that he's staying up at uh, 2300 hours their time and that we can get one more QSO with him today. We got him. November Alpha 1, Sierra Sierra, Kilo Fox 7, Echo Tango X ray. I'm just going to be quiet and listen. Tail end of the pass here. Two minutes left of the pass. You can see they're just passing out over the top there. Uh, footprint is coming up right here.
why they're coming in good. Right now they're just over Saskatchewan, Canada, right in the mid uh, portion there, right between Calgary and Winnipeg. We're still getting a pretty good signal. No way that I could transmit to him, but uh, we can definitely listen. We've got a big footprint. Now we might be losing him now. The footprint is just um, just off the coast of. Uh, Canada and uh, the Pacific Northwest. You need to use the uplink of 144490 Alpha Delta 7 X-ray. Someone trying to talk on the uh, downlink here. All right, well, thanks for stopping back by my temporary ham shack. I had a great afternoon anticipating passes and getting a chance to make a QSO with the International Space Station. USN ER Doc, out.